Today I show you how to get time lapse footage off of this GoPro into that computer in no time. Okay, so within Premiere, Control I for import, and you navigate to wherever the folder is that has all of the files. Now I start from the first frame of the time lapse. In this case, it's here when the lights turn on because here it, we were, I was in darkness. And here's the entire trick. Here's where it is. Lower left corner says image sequence. Make sure that is checked and say open. That's it. There it is. That's your entire sequence. That's the entire time lapse. So you can drag that over into your timeline. Now you can have a new timeline where it's, uh, it's, it's properly 1080, uh, 30 frames a second or, or whatever you want it to be at. Uh, and you say keep existing settings. If you say change sequence settings, it's going to give you this four by three look to it because it's a photograph, so it's not widescreen. Now this is much larger resolution than 1080, so you can actually play with this. So let's go ahead and say Control N for, for a new sequence. Let's say AVC HD is 1080, um, and just call this uh, GoPro. All right, and let's drag that right over to it. No, let's keep existing settings because I don't. I want it to stay the the widescreen. Zoom to the sequence. Now it's kind of zoomed in a little bit too much. Let's say you want to. Scale it out. And now you can play with the framing a little bit too since it is uh, a bit high. There we go. There you go. That is it. I hope this helps you create even more great stunning time lapses now that you know how to ingest this into Premiere so much easier. I'd love to see what you create. Leave a link to your work in the comments below. I'd love to see them. Have a good one.